Hey guys, welcome back to Journal Art Pit. It's me Zainab Altaf and today in this video, I'm going to show you how to off find my iPhone in which uh, which we can also say FMI off. In full free, this is lifetime free which also unlocks your SIM. So as you can see, my iPhone is in passcode lock and first of all, we will run Checkrin, so boot into it. So here we are in it. First of all, we're going to connect our iPhone to the PC. So if you have iOS 14.4.1, 14.4.2 or 14.4, then you have to click on options. Now you have to click on the first option which says allow untested iOS versions. And then we have to click on back. So now to begin, we have to click on start. Now we have to click on OK. Then we have to click on next. And as you can see, iPhone is entering recovery mode. Now we have to click on start and it will instruct us to put our phone into DFU mode according to our devices. So if I click on start, it is going to instruct me to put my phone into DFU mode according to my device. Now it is booting. Let's wait. So as you can see, it is all done. It means it is done. Now we will boot to Windows to off find my iPhone. So we are in Windows and first of all, we have to disable the antivirus. So let's first disable the antivirus. Manage settings, off and yes. So now here's the tool. And I'm going to show you the tool. The link for the tool is in down description box. So let's first extract the tool. For that we have a password. Look at the password very carefully to extract the tool. And now I have to click on OK. So here's the extracted one folder and we have to open it from here. So let's open it. And here you will find out two tools. Uh, first of all, you have to open the second one tool here, the down one over here so this is the tool actually but before that I want to show you that my iPhone's FMI is actually on so here's the website the link for the website is in down description box I have given my I IMEI and let's check whether it's on or off so as you can see I told you that my find my iPhone is on so now we will go to tool to make it off so you can see it is on so now here are we are with the tool and we are going to off our FMI. So you have to connect your iPhone to the PC. It should be connected. So now you have to click on iOS 12X. Whether you have any iPhone, remember that you have to click on iOS 12X. Even when you have any iOS, you have to click on iOS 12X. I'm saying it again. So now you can see here some tokens. So here they are. You ha don't have to do anything here. You have to open the first one tool as I told you. Let's go there. So as you can see, these are the tokens. So let's open the upper one tool right here. So we have to open this. And what I'm going to do is we are going to copy and paste. What we are going to do is look at this very carefully. We are first going to copy the app token, which is written over here. So we are going to copy all of this. Do it as I'm doing. So let's copy it. And now let's paste it over here. And the next thing we're going to do is we are going to copy the next option, which is X Apple IMD. So let's op copy this and now let's paste it over here. And the last thing to do is we have to copy the last option right here, which is written over here. So let's copy it, the third one. And now let's paste it over here. So now you have to click on the check option, which is written over here. So let's click on it. So now it is all done. Now what we are going to do is you have to choose remove according to your model. So my model is iPhone 6s. So I'm going to remove over here. As you can see, I have iPhone 6s. So I'm going to click on remove. You have to click uh, on the remove according to your model. So now you can see it is all done now. 
So again, to check out whether the FMI is off or on, we are going to go again on the same website and gonna write my IMEI. So let's write it over here. And now let's check out. So as you can see, it is successfully off. Find my iPhone is off and now your SIM is going to work. Everything is going to work in it. And you can also reset your iPhone and it will again work. You can restore your iPhone, it will work. So now we are going to open the 3U tools. So after opening the 3U tools, your iPhone must be connected and you have to power off your iPhone and put your iPhone into recovery mode. You can search out on Google that how to put your phone into recovery mode according to your device. So now what we are going to do is we are going to flash with the iOS firmware. You can download the firmware from the link which is down in the description box and now we have to wait for it. Until you wait, subscribe to my YouTube channel and click on the bell icon to get every new notification. So let's wait for it. So as you can see it is all done and we are in hello screen but this time the iPhone is going to be unlocked. So let me do some setups and show you that it is successfully unlocked. Everything is going to work in it. Notification, iCloud sign in, App Store, on off, Siri, everything is going to work it along with your SIM. And even if you reset your, it is going to work. You have to give your internet password to it. And as I was saying, if you restore, reset your iPhone, it is going to again work. So as you can see, it is successfully unlocked. Now we are on the home screen and as you can see, it is successfully done and unlocked. So now I am going to go in settings to show you my iOS version and my iPhone. So as you can see, I have iOS version 14.4.2 and my iPhone is 6S. You can also recheck my IMEI, which is the same iPhone. So now I'm going to insert the SIM to show you that SIM is also working and is successfully fixed. So let me insert the SIM. And as you can see, it is searching. So now you can see notification is also fixed and you can also see the network name and the network signals. Let me show you. You can see here they are and the SIM is fixed. Now I'm going to make a call to show you that call is also fixed, SIM call is also fixed. So let me make a call. So as you can see it is calling means SIM is fixed. It is 100% working. Now I will end the call, it is successfully fixed. So now I'm going to power it off to show you that on off is also fixed. I'm not showing you iCloud sign in or something because the video would be so long. So as you can see on off is also fixed. Hope, hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching this video.